Welcome to the Native Diamond Podcast. Oh, shit! What you waiting for? What's up, everyone? Seth Mick here, back at it again with another reaction review video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you could, please like the video, hit subscribe, ring that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I drop a new reaction, review video, or podcast episode. Today, I am reacting and reviewing to the new Memphis Mayfire official music video for Blood and Water. I cannot wait to check this out, okay? It's been a minute, hasn't it, since we've seen some Memphis Mayfire. They were definitely one of those bands that got me into the core scene if you will i just remember seeing them at warp tour and stuff like that so i guess the nostalgia is there let's see if it's any good stick around we're going to talk about the song at the end of the video we're going to read some comments as well so let's get it Ooh, is that like a new logo okay Ooh. Okay. I used to take Oh, oh, I was gonna pause it, but no, I'm not. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. I like that West Dead is Dead line. Oh, clean sound good. Bro, this is pretty fucking good. Okay. Ugh. Alright, hold on. Like, they're, they're coming out swinging. Like, it's like, I haven't heard from them in a while. And then they come out with this heaviness. Like, not too crazy about the whole aesthetic. But, I mean, I think the song. The song, though. The song is, like, bringing it, though. Ah, this is fucking filthy right here. That rip. Ah, Mandy has such good cleans. Okay. You just gotta admit it. This is a catchy motherfucker right here, dude. This has this like weird while she sleeps vibe to me though. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Ugh. Ugh. This is good, dude. Woo. Okay. okay. That that what? <laughs> what? Drummer's a beast, man. I gotta mention that. Ooh. 
Nice. Damn. Okay. I see you. I see you, Memphis Mayfire. Right, let's do a live comment before we get into reading all the other comments. Dear Memphis Mayfire. Let's read it. Dear Memphis Mayfire, it's been a while, hasn't it? My ears needed that. Much appreciated. Love the new logo. Also, straight from Native Diamond Podcast. We do that around here now. Live, Live comments. comments. Let's, Let's get, get it. it. Next comment. It's always Nick Nocturnal. Would you guess otherwise? <laughs> he comments, yes, dude. Thank you. Dude, that's what I'm talking about. I'm glad that Nick likes it because I like this song as well. Memphis Mayfire with the heat. Bring him the f***ing heater. Next comment. This rips man of little words but yes this does actually rip next comment caliber tv oh shit. memphis with the heat it looks like a lot of people are um really taking on to this i'm seeing a lot of like really fire comments from uh some well-respected people so this is really sick um, from ashes to new straight fire i want to see what these replies are saying agreed memphis may fire I see what you did. I love you guys. Let's go. Love you guys. It looks like everyone's basically loving it. Uh, next comment. Dear Memphis May Fire. Hey, don't steal my comment thing, okay? But anyway. Yes, finally, yes. 2010 emo kids. We still here. That looks like the ongoing theme lately, isn't it? Like, this stuff never really gets old, I guess. You know what I mean? Like, everyone's still in that emo phase or that warp Tour phase. Obviously, a lot of people are still very much impacted by these bands that are from 2010. They're still, like, coming out with good songs. So, yeah, let's get uh, it. Next comment. This is what the new A Day to Remember should have sounded like. I'm seeing a lot of likes here. I liked it as well. Resentment was good, but yeah, the rest of the album was a bit weak. I'm kind of noticing that in all these kind of, like, scene core, like, like type bands whatever if you want to call it metalcore i'm seeing a lot of shade being thrown on your welcome in the comments uh what was the other one chunk no captain um i saw a lot of shade there as well I, it just seems like everyone's kind of going elsewhere for that easy core sound or whatever you want to call it i'm not throwing shade that sounds so bad easy core is not a bad thing it's next comment maddie still one of my favorite vocalists in any genre kills the cleans kills the screams dude is amazing even after all these years dude i'm not gonna lie this guy he sings so good he sings good basically memphis may fire was like a big part of me getting into like heavier music i don't know if that's crazy to hear for some people but it really was it was like a stepping stone and the guy belts it live as well like i saw him at warp tour they were like one of the last people to play on the big stage and dude they slay they are so good live and they deserve all the respect that they're given in love you know why not all right anyway let's skim through some of these before we talk about what we liked and didn't like uh the devil is prada and memphis may fire going back to their heavy roots is making every fan of the metalcore genre excited about metal again this is f***ing sick this is exactly what we wanted Okay. All right, everyone's liking it, dude. I'm seeing a lot of fire. I'm seeing a lot of yeses. I'm seeing a lot of thumbs up. Okay. So 25,000 people like it, liked it, and 222 people disliked it. Okay. Obviously, the ratio likes to dislike. Likes are in likes favor. But uh, let's talk about what I liked and didn't like. What I liked about it is a few moments later i mean memphis mayfire came pretty strong and heavy with this one okay i didn't expect it to be this like he heavy honestly love that they're still with rise love that there's still some big names under rise records it just makes me happy for some reason it threw me off right at the end it felt like it was just gonna be like a generic ending or a generic structure or whatever but that bridge or whatever at the end it really just it mind effed me you know what I mean? Like, that shit was crazy. I liked it a lot. Memphis Mayfire is back, guys. I mean, I don't know what to say. Uh, I'm pretty excited. Can't wait to see what they have else in store for us this year. What did you guys think? Drop that in the comments. Please, if you enjoyed the video, please like the video. Hit share. Subscribe. Ring that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I drop a new video. You don't want to miss out, right? So, uh, anyway, hope you guys crush it this week. Go jam some more Memphis Mayfire. Listen to the old stuff and compare and contrast the new from the old, right? Till next time. Shine on. Shine on. Shine on. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah.